This uh, project is a uh, fish barrier removal project. You can see behind me the new bridge that's uh, put in. Prior to this, there was a causeway that carried traffic over it, and there was two uh, cul two culverts through the causeway. But the uh, the channel that's here now was was non-existent. So this project is really driven at um, connecting up Oak Bay to Killset Harbor for juvenile salmon is we're the real driver to get juvenile salmon to be able to migrate from the south to the north and get into Killset Harbor. Um, and at the same time, it did a significant amount of restoration for the water quality in Killset Harbor, which had been used historically to this daily influx of water from Oak Harbor. It got cut off when the causeway got put in in the 40s. That damaged the salt marsh, that damaged bird life, that damaged the water quality in Killset Harbor. Um, it changed the way that humans use the waterway as far as you could no longer paddle through here or bring a boat through here. And immediately upon opening, uh, there was a red algae bloom up in Killison Harbor when we happened to open this up. And you could see, you could visually see the clear water from Oak Bay spilling into this red algae bloom and just kind of starting to dilute it. The water started to cool. Um, so we know that it's going to change the temperatures and the water quality in Killison Harbor and make it kind of better for all the animals and people that use the area.